Oh no, 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 no! No! Don't! Oh. Oh, there it goes. Oh, I'm so sorry. Hello, my wolf pack puppies. So, you may notice some things are a bit different. Like how many sims I have in my household. More than eight, that's for sure. So, you know those elder sims in your neighborhood who just live around in the world or who aren't currently in the world? And they have aspirations of their own, but they're pretty old. And it might not be likely that they can achieve those aspirations. Well, I created a very nice retirement center where all of these elders can live together and rest and live ha happily and comfortably for the rest of their days. We're gonna play through that. <laughs> Some of these sims have eight days left to live, so when they pass, some of them might overlap. But anyway, enough with being paused. Let's get their life started. I guess I should uh, introduce you to them. So I'm just learning about them myself to basically everyone needs to eat. So basically I'm gonna have all of them cook something. Oh, looks like this guy here. So I'm actually gonna make you cook a group meal. Come on buddy. I'm going to have Juan cook something till all of the tabletops are covered with Sims cooking. All right, so some of them are already starting to cook. I'm having them all make a salad because I don't want anyone to catch on fire and I don't want any untimely deaths. That's the thing, I, I hate it when my sims um, die of like a fire or electrocution, so I go back on a save and just kinda, you know, take care of them. Yeah, so some of them are just learning how to cook. There are a lot of acquired the cooking skill notifications. All right, let's see how many of them have made a salad already. Oh, there we go. Looks like Gabrielle has finished. You can put that away. Looks like some of them are already eating the salad. That's good. Ooh, who's this made by? Ah, Rahim. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that name right. Please correct me. Oh, you know, one time I had two houses on one lot. And I had two Sim families cook something and put it in there in each of their fridges. But I found out something. They couldn't get out the food that the other sim in the other house made. She'll I'll let you know around. of anything else. Now, I did have an earlier version of the retirement center Eat up in the gallery. I don't have this one in because I just built it. I'd like to see if oh, I have Krishna. enough beds for everyone. I should assign those. Here we go. Alrighty, I have assigned all of the beds to each of these sims. It's interesting, looking at some of these sims' aspirations, some of them want to become a part of the occult. Wow, a lot of them. Like, sometimes a spellcaster, sometimes a vampire. Wow, we have a lot of people that want to become vampires. One that wants to be a parent. Oh, I'm not sure if we'll be able to achieve these. I mean, maybe if we really pushed it, but that's not the goal of this. The goal is to make sure that they live a happy life. So I'm gonna be taking care of some of these Sims that look uncomfortable, or... I'm realizing that a lot of these Sims are having the same reactions, like they're bored, their backs are cracking. Oh, wow, we have a whole gaggle right here. Oh, some of them have work. Everly has work? No, ever. Everly should be retired. Yeah, I'm gonna have all of them retire. <laughs> okay, so I added some benches for the elderly to sit. I'm gonna have everything in like three times speed, just so that it doesn't get too boring. Oh, and this is a little place to honor the people who have passed. I actually created um, in Newcrest a nice little built cemetery. They're all gathering around here. I don't know why. So I noticed that because I didn't age any of these elders, cause you know, I like to play with all of the Sims that I can. That 
the youngest sim. And you can tell because they're the last in the line is also eight days. So I have a feeling we're gonna lose a lot of sims. Sometimes I like to pair two sims together. Like, I'll make them a couple while they live in the retirement center. They're not really using the bathroom when they need to. I gotta like check on them to make sure. Oh my gosh, get out. Let them use the bathroom. I love how I just got this notification. Too many sims in one place. Is this max capacity? Is this now a fire hazard? What if the ground opens up? Maybe it is time for Juan Manuel to sneak out. <gasps> is one of my sims actually gonna try and sneak out? Or is it like a fear? Cause I've never gotten this notification before. Oh, it's a fear of crowded places. Wow, I've never gotten that before, like ever. Even in like a public space. Oh no, 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 no! No! Don't! Oh. Well, it looks like he hasn't had a bladder accident yet, but maybe I can save- Nope. Oh, there it goes. Oh, I'm so sorry. I was trying to get you to a toilet, but there are so many sims. I know, and you're scared of large crowds. What is it with people just kind of staying in- Like, leave. Give him some privacy. No, 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 no. Please- Please don't have a- wait, which one are you? Oh, no, 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 please. Please don't have a, a bladder accident. Okay, I'm checking all of the others. Well, hold on, I missed one. Okay, she needs to use the bathroom too. Where is she? Oh, she's over there. Come on, you can get to the bathroom. Come on, why are you just standing there? Let's go use the bathroom. She's kind of just standing there, so... Okay, now she's finally going. I used to play just eight sims, but then I realized how many elder sims I have. So I'm going to have some of them try and use the bathroom before that happens. What? No, you have a bed. Go to your assigned bed. All right, my wolf pack puppies. I'm going to get everything sorted, and if something else crazy happens, I'll be right back. Oops. Oops.